Hi. So, don't actually want a cube. Uh, my audio is probably not very good because I've moved my computer because it's so cold in the UK now. This is just a quick how to evict with Pyro. Um, it's actually take three because take one the audio didn't record, take two I crashed and so this is take three. So um, I should know what I'm doing by now in theory. So I can just crack on. I crashed when I was um, I've added collided tags to the soft bodies and I was zooming in and out while I was playing I suppose but I don't know whether it's my system but obviously Pyro is a bit more demanding than So, small spheres. Uh, make them soft body. Do I risk? No, I don't. So, are we are going to clone those in the volume of the cube. Make it editable. And then currently they won't be affected, and they'll also fall down. So we'll get rid of gravity. Huh. As you can see, no infection. You've got to come into here and just give this a tweak to a fairly small value. And there you go. Easy advection of soft bodies. Um, I think we can come in here and uh, where do we want to go? Mix animation with force. And then they should follow their position a bit. Or something. <laughs> so I'm not going to do any rendering or anything. That's over to you. Um, or even having good settings for your soft bodies, because mine are clearly rubbish. Um, I'm just going to check how this goes and then record advecting splines. But obviously, you can probably put two and two together. But um, there's a lot of. Like you should have to play with settings a lot. There's just tons of settings now, so um, just explore really. Okay. Oh yeah. Um, if you found this useful, don't forget to leave a like, uh, comment, subscribe. I might make some more advanced videos in the near future. Okay, cheers.